Hi, this is Dr. Gary Sharp. It is the 21st of April 2017. I've been out thinking Parkinson's now for over a year and I've come very far in my understanding of my, myself and the disease and how it affects people. And one of the conclusions I've come to is that Parkinson's is a disintegration of the self where essentially the mind, the gut, the body and various aspects of your emotions and your personality get fragmented and we, we stop what I think of as habitualising our own bodies. We stop listening to the signals, the pain signals and the feedback between the gut, the brain and the body and the emotions and various aspects of your personality and it all gets broken. And one of the things I'm finding in terms of Parkinson's healing is that to really truly heal, no drug can do it. There's no quick fix because you have to reintegrate yourself. And you have to start habitualizing your own body again. So, so your mind and your body needs to be reconnected. And one of the things I've been exploring is the concept of vibration. So people with Parkinson's tremor a lot. I don't particularly have the tremor, but a lot of people do. And doctors see that as a pathology or, or a malfunction. Now, what I believe is that, that is actually the body trying to get back with the mind and, and trying to integrate itself again, but it's stuck. So one of the important things is vibrational therapy. Uh, I've been doing a lot of work with Irene Treacy of uh, Smoothie Island, and you can see my smoothie rings there. That they vibrate the arms when you swing them. But what I found out speaking anecdotally to people with Parkinson's is that vibrating plate therapies work. Now I contacted vibrating plate therapy companies and explored if they would send me one to trial. And today I've got one from Reviber. Here it is. And I've just set it up and this is the first time I'm going to try it. So I'm going to see how this feels. And over the next few months, we're going to explore whether vibration therapy can be highly beneficial in people with Parkinson's to relieve the symptoms and to heal by reintegrating the mind and body. So I'm, I'm going to, this is the first time I'm going to be using it. And I thought I'd record it. So let's start by just sitting on it. This is on a slower speed, and it certainly feels strange, and it certainly is a, is a, certainly, a, well, actually quiet, I can't even speak. It's certainly given me a new experience of my body. Uh, so let's, let's something else. Let's try kneeling. So I'm on at the moment, which means the drugs are working, I've got my mood. Um, what I really want to explore later on is when I'm off and, and I can't move the pads, the movement because of the pads and the symptoms of the drugs aren't effective. And this is what happens with people with pads, they come on and off through, through the symptom cycle, the drug cycle is explore if that will help alleviate the, the muscle stiffness and rigidity that people with Parkinson's get. So this, this is a bit like the smoothie rings, um, which by swinging them, they're, they're designed to re, re establish Connection between the hands and the brain to the vibration. And these are really, really very effective. I recommend them to anybody. I think this is kind of a similar thing. This is a slow speed. You know, it just, this is not sensation. Uh, now let's try standing on it. Here we go. 
I can certainly feel there's, there's, there's some therapeutic value in this, and it's adding into the the quality of life interventions, um, which will help people with Parkinson's relearn how to move and how how to re-establish the signals between muscles and nerves in the body and brain. So again, this is a study speed, but I can feel the balance issues. Um, so I think this will help definitely help to re-establish balance in people with Parkinson's. Uh, Ooh. Yeah. So that's my first experience, and we will follow this as, as we progress and, and see just how therapeutic it is. But that first experience, I, I do feel there's going to be some very interesting effects for me. Stay tuned. <laughs>